Hello, everybody. Welcome aboard Plasma 1945 with a Labor Day multi-role mission for you. This mission is set in the Persian Gulf. You will be crossing it to take out some targets. Now, this mission is based on the mission from an F-117 game from about 30 years ago, to which you can see a link in the top corner here. But back to this actual mission. You'll be crossing the Persian Gulf to take out ground targets or to suppress air defenses or to provide cap. In this mission, if you're flying with pilots online on a multiplayer server, you can choose those roles and define them as required, or you can fly by yourself with the help of AI. The AI is programmed to take off from the main airbase and either do seed, cap, or air to ground, and you choose which role you want to do by just not spawning that group of fighters. Now, you can also take off from the Tarawa, but before we get to Tarawa, let's talk about the briefing and the radio communications. To activate pilots for the briefing, open up the radio menu and choose other. Good evening, pilots. To interrupt the supplies and funding of the neo extremists who have. And you should hear a briefing like that. Now, if the briefing doesn't kick in, make sure your audio settings are turned up as you can see on the screen. Taken over the Hormoz gun and part of Fars and Kerman province. And the reason this is important, there are actual audio cues and uh, communications that are occurring in the air while you're flying to help you along, give you some tips and advice. Now, from the same menu, if you go to other, you can request an F-15 cap support, air to air support, seed, or air to ground. As you activate these groups, the pilots will jump in their airplanes and start taxiing. And this is where you can really decide what sort of a mission you can fly. So it's actually three missions in one. You want to fly air to ground? Well, you can spawn in the cap and the seed aircraft to take out the SAMs and the air defenses, and you can do the air to ground work. Now, if you want to fly the harm mission and take out the radars, you can do that as well by spawning the air to air and the air to ground guys with the guided bombs. You can even do the whole mission by yourself by making multiple trips back and forth. Uh, but that's a bit of a challenge. Now, if you're flying something like a Harrier or a helicopter, there is a Tarawa out in the Persian Gulf from which you can take off. And if you're doing a deep strike with a Harrier, well, call in those F-15s to take off just as you're taking off and they'll start mopping up the air defenses and you can spawn up the seed guys and they will take off and start taking out the SAMs by the time you get to the target zone. Lots of options. I hope you enjoyed this mission. As always, leave comments, likes, and if you want to see the Red Star guys flying this mission and how the game from 32 years ago looks compared to DCS World, it's in the description. Plasma's out of here.